it's the Rawsome Vegan Gal here and I've got some products I am showing you from a company called Back to the Roots and I want to thank Ali for sending the products to me for me to taste because I've never tried them before and to let you know what I think and also to talk to you about this company so the products that I'm holding up here are called Organic Breakfast Toppers they're really nice. They're in three different flavors. They have blueberries, almond, and buckwheat. That's one of them, and really nice packaging. And this one is their dates, coconut, and chia seeds. And then their third one is their raisins, sunflower seeds, and buckwheat. So I want to tell you a bit, a little bit about this company. They are they're they're say making food personal again. So they have two different lines of products. They have a ready-to-eat product, which are, this is one of the uh, products from that line, the breakfast toppers, and they also have ready-to-grow products. So the interesting story behind this company, two, uh, two gentlemen that uh, started this, it says, in our college class we learned that mushrooms could grow on recycled coffee grounds. After watching hours of how-to videos and turning our fraternity kitchen into a big science product, we decided to give up our corporate jobs to instead become full-time mushroom farmers. What started as curiosity about urban farming has turned into a passion for, quote, undoing food and recommend re reconnecting families to it through fun, delicious, and sustainable, quote, ready-to-grow and, quote, ready-to-eat products. So that's Alejandro and Nikhil, if I'm pronouncing his name right. So we're going to talk to you about, first, their... Um, ready to eat products and then hopefully in the future I'll be doing another video um, on ready to grow products. So they have a few different um, types of products. They have their stone ground flakes. So here's a picture. It comes in a in a box and uh, what they try to do is they're minimizing the excess of packaging. So there's no plastic bag. It's um, first no bag in a box so it's just a box and so they use 25% less material and non-toxic vegetable ink. So, and there's only three ingredients in that. Then they have what's called their organic stone ground crisps. And then that's just a snack on the go. It's wrapped in a compostable packaging uh, made from a sustainably sourced wood pulp and printed using water-based inks. So that's really nice too. And then their breakfast toppers, which is what I'm going to review. And... Um, it says here, they're simple and flavorful organic breakfast toppers. Bring fun and, and do it yourself back to the breakfast category. Add these unique fruit, nut, and seed mixes, because each one only has three ingredients, to your cereal, oatmeal, yogurt, and more, or just eat it as a snack. When you're on the go, shake it up, mix up the ingredients, and just have it as a snack. So the packaging is really unique, too. Each uh, can contains eight, eight servings in a stackable reusable and 100% recyclable steel cans. These are steel, they're not aluminum. And um, so that's really good to, to know that. So they do everything sustainably and it comes in, it's really cool. It actually has a tab that you lift up. So we're going to do that right now. And then it has even a little, the plastic cover is actually recyclable too. So we're going to lift up the tab and pull it back. And you have to be careful with these because they are sharp. And then that could be recycled too. And then you can see the inside. If I can get it in the camera. Let me get in the camera here. I don't think I, I... I'm not getting it in properly. So let me try again. There you go. Now you can see the ingredients. So this is the raisin, uh, sunflower seeds, and buckwheat. So it's got complete protein full of all nine essential amino acids. This just to tell you it's gluten-free, kosher, USDA organic non-GMO, no added sugar, and all U.S. grown. So they grow their raisins in California, and their buckwheat and sunflower seeds are from North Dakota. Now, in case you don't know about buckwheat, buckwheat is actually not a true grain. It is not even related to wheat, even though it's called buckwheat. And it says here it was first grown over 5,000 years ago in Central Asia, and is one of the few plants that contains all nine essential amino acids. So that's really nice. So what we can do is we take the cover and we can shake it up, And then we can try some. Now the raisins give it a nice sweetness. 
And um, I like that. I like that mixture with buckwheat. I actually am a fan of buckwheat, so that tastes really nice. Very mild. It's got 4% iron, 2% calcium in three tablespoons, and there's eight servings in here. So that's really nice. And it's got some protein as well and carbs and potassium. The next one we're going to try is the dates, coconut, and chia seeds. So this one um, has more iron in it. I believe from the dates, the dates have more iron. It's got 6% iron and 6% calcium and 2% vitamin C in three tablespoons. And it says here, dates are packed with electrolytes like potassium and magnesium. Are often eaten by marathon runners for long-lasting energy. This so this is made from... Dates are from Tunisia, chia seeds from Paraguay, and coconut from the Philippines. So it's an international variety. So we're gonna uh, we're gonna open that up. We're gonna get up, pick up the pull tab here first. And this one has got four grams of fibers as well. And <laughs> so this one, I don't know if I could show it to you how it looks, but I'm gonna shake it up first. Ooh. I didn't cover it, right? I shook it up a little too fast. <laughs> Make sure your cover is on securely when you shake up your container because everything would go flying otherwise. So be really careful because the, the plastic cover is not so uh, vacuum secure on the uh, container. So be careful, especially this one with the chia seeds. So, so let's see if I can get that in the camera for you to see. I'm not getting the right light. So I don't know that you could see it. Let's try maybe on this side. Maybe you could see, there you go, maybe you could see it now. So this has got the um, dates, the chia seeds, and the coconut. So we're going to try some of this. Mmm. That's really nice. I'm a fan of um, all the ingredients. That's really nice. I would probably put this also on a salad. A fruit salad would be nice, adding some dried fruit. This has a really nice flavor. I like the I like the mix of those three ingredients. It's really nice. And the final one is our blueberry almonds and buckwheat. And this is also all US grown. And um, this in, in three tablespoons it's got two percent calcium and two percent iron. Um, so this is the blueberry, almond, and buckwheat. So this as well has buckwheat, like our other topper, the raisin, sunflower, and buckwheat. So uh, here it says the blueberries are from Oregon, the buckwheat is from North Dakota, and the almonds from California. We're going to open this container up carefully. And we're going to cover it and shake it up. Again, hold your... Hold your cover on it while you're shaking. And this does have a little rim on the top, so the, some of the ingredients might come around there just to be aware after you shake it up to make sure that doesn't spill all over the place. So let's see if we can get this for you in the camera to see what that looks like. I'm not sure if you're seeing it or not. So it's got blueberry. Here's the blueberry. Actually, the blueberry has some buckwheat attached to it. Mmm, mm, that's nice. We're going to try a little more with the almond. Mmm, that's really nice too. I like that. Got a nice flavor. Antioxidant boost, it says on the bottom here. Um, let's see if this one says something else. The, the date one says long lasting energy. I like that. Definitely, I would have this more as a snack. A pick-me-up snack. This is a great afternoon pick-me-up snack. When you're looking for something to eat, you want something healthy, instead of getting, <coughs> excuse me, Ooh. instead of getting something that, from the corner store, that is not going to be beneficial to you, better to have something like these breakfast toppers, which can be eaten all day. You know, this doesn't have to be just for breakfast. It could be any time of day you're looking for a snack, something healthy. Um, a on, a, on a road trip, what's great about these is they don't spoil. So you can take this with you on a road trip. Now, you, want to be, you might want to be careful. Like I was saying, the cover is not that secure. So if you're traveling with these, 
You might want to tape them down at, when you're traveling so that the covers don't fall off, especially if they're not upright. So you might want to tape them around so that they stay. But yeah, this is great. You're traveling, hiking, hiking food. This is great for hiking. Um, you know, when you're going on a long trek somewhere or after your workout, when you exercise, this would be great after exercise snack to give you energy and antioxidants and all different kinds of um, beneficial nutrients that your body needs. So, so yeah, this is, this is a great option. Um, I think it's wonderful that they, the company is making these products. And the other products are the, uh, the ready to grow products. I will hopefully talk about in another video because one of the products that I would love to try out is they have something called Garden in a Can. So hopefully look for that in the future when I will actually show you what it looks like and show you it as it's growing. So that would be really, that's a great concept too, that you can have your stuff that you can grow yourself, even if you live in a small space. So here are, again, the three products that I review. They are the Breakfast Toppers, organic from Back to the Roots. This one is the Blueberry, Almonds, and Buckwheat. And then we have the dates, coconut, and chia seeds. And finally, we have the raisins, sunflower seeds, and buckwheat. So I will have a link below this video for you to check out this company and all the products and everything that they're doing. And I hope you will try them out because they look like a wonderful addition to your snack or toppings for any kind of food that you're going to eat. So I thank you for watching. It's the Rossum Vegan Gal.